Okay, I think we may be, let's see, roughly going live in a few seconds now. Probably one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> yeah, what? <laughs> hey, we're live. Man. Okay, one hour, buddy. One more day. Yep. It's Mar it's April sixth, two thousand eight, Boise, Idaho. On eleven at eleven, and we're live. Apparently, we're so told. Right, man. <laughs> and I want to say happy birthday to. At it too. Tyler Booth. His 18th birthday will be on Wednesday. Say that again. Tyler Tyler Booth. His 18th birthday will be on Wednesday. So I want to say happy birthday to Tyler Booth. Happy birthday, Tyler. Happy 18th birthday. Yeah. What? Close the door. And maybe we'll do that again later, Joe. <laughs> 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 Down, down, man. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Yeah, yep, got the doors closed. Coming to you, man. Hi. Hey, what's happening? This is a strawberry banana smoothie, and it's real yummy. Hey, Boise. <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> what? Nothing. Yeah, see if I can. Hey, Mama. Oh. Hey there. Hi. <laughs> We're chilling here with you tonight. Or without you, if you're not there. <laughs> right. In which case, we missed you. As much as you can miss somebody that you don't know isn't there. <laughs> oh, and I want to say hello to Melody if she's still in town visiting with Sarah. I hope they had a wonderful visit, have had a wonderful visit. And if she's still here, I hope it continues. Cool. That's awesome. <laughs> her and I believe her son, or, I mean daughter. Son, oops. <laughs> I read the email on Monday and I've been... Mm. Alright. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, hey. Melody <laughs> and your child. <laughs> and Sarah and everyone. And this is footage of us at Craters of the Moon. Right. Earlier this year. Did those come out at o'clock, babe? No. Uh, no, I shouldn't have. It should be up no, there on the wall. No, I did. Are you talking about the other clock? <laughs> That's in that other desk. Ooh. You want me to go get it? Huh? Do some of that. Oh, see, look at what with all this with the stage moved back like this. The yeah. lights are, are like really hot right here, like uh, really like bright. So I look really bright. I gotta do some like really trippy credits moon credits of the moon music. <laughs> There. Oh, yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> I could get a tan. Woohoo! Actually, I think I'll just move the couch out. Yeah! Woohoo! Up out of these lights. Okay, that might be better. Yeah, that'll work. <laughs> I hope it doesn't throw the balance of the whole set off. Nope. Uh, I think we're good. <laughs> we'll show some yeah, crater, craters. Craters, yeah. Okay. So, I keep, ha I have this one story stuck in my head that we were hmm. discussing this week at Yada. Hmm. But it's so gruesome. <laughs> so sad. Yeah. <laughs> and people just want to lynch this girl and I totally understand why but at the same time wow you know what if she was that confused and uninformed 
<laughs> right. Do you know the story I'm talking about? Uh, give me a hint. I'm gonna see if I. No, I don't think I've mentioned to you this. Oh, a new one. <laughs> yeah, this 14-year-old girl who tried to flush her baby down the toilet. Oh my God. In her high school. And they're not. They weren't pursuing murder charges right away. Really? And people were like, "Why not?" And I'm like, "Well, because maybe because maybe she was panicked, or maybe she was. I mean, there are girls who are that, who really don't know. When you know, no one's told them anything, and they just don't know. And scary. All kinds of circumstances under which they might even get to that point and not even know that they're pregnant. I know it sounds far out, but I've seen it happen. Well, I've known a couple people to whom it has supposedly happened. You can never know for sure. I can't do it. Hello. How are you? Hey. Uh, nope. Not there. <laughs> what a story to try open again. on, man. Yeah, what the heck, man? That is gruesome. <laughs> Buddy, you know that when we do this show, you have to make a couple concessions. Enough. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Good save. <laughs> take since we have three cameras we need to do one for you one for me and one for him right. oh, I know babe oh. I'd be mad at me too <laughs> oh hey how you doing hello 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 say something <laughs> are you there hello nope bye bye <laughs> Please. no babe. I tried man I tried to answer Look at the, look at the, look at the monitor, babe. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. White now balance. that's good stuff. That's good TV. White balance. <laughs> Let's do more of that. <laughs> Woo! No, no, not at me. Up in the air. Up in the air. Up in the air. Okay. Are we getting cranky now? <laughs> no. We're not. No. We sound cranky. We sound cranky pretty baby. cranky. Cranky baby. No, we sound cranky oh, baby. Stays there. We sound pretty cranky. Yeah. That's my Kleenex in case my nose burns. So. <laughs> Let's find a less gruesome subject. Yeah, like Craters of the Moon. Yeah, Craters of the Moon is cool. And some really weird... Ooh. Can you hear that? What? Uh, can you hear the music out there? No. Oh, well. Yeah. You don't even know what I'm doing in here, man. <laughs> and they're going, what is with this? Well, if you haven't been with us before, this is Moments of Awareness <laughs> with Peace and the Dudes. Right. And How we come into the studio every Sunday night from 11 to midnight and we <laughs> talk to people. And we mess with the toys in here. <laughs> yep. And we show footage of stuff that we find interesting. And other people might too. <laughs> and if not, oh well. Sorry. <laughs> You can hear it now. Yep. Isn't that cool? Yep. Magma bubble. Perfect, huh? Yep. And I like the theme for tonight, too. It's yeah. a good theme. Yes, dear? Yeah. See, that's a good subject right there. DVD, yeah. That's nice, huh? Oh, you're covering it. I see. What Hello. Doing? How are you doing? Hello. Hello. <laughs> Oh my gosh. You realize it's a tough on TV. <laughs> Excuse me? What? We realize what? I don't know what she said. <laughs> she either said we realize this is going out on TV or we're really live <laughs> going on TV or something. I don't, I'm not sure exactly. We'll have to watch it and play back. That'll be fun. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops! I she think that's mostly what she said was whoops. Yeah. Oh my God, they're live! <laughs> this is actually going out on Someone TV. Someone actually answered the phone. Those are lava tubes. <laughs> hey, 
Are we allowed to videotape stuff in Creative Zoom Moon and show it on TV? Yep. <laughs> okay, I just thought I'd ask. Copyright us, too. Shame. <laughs> oh, thank you. You're helping me blow my nose. Thank you. Yeah. I appreciate well. that. Not right now, babe. <laughs> you have chocolate milk right there. No. Hey, Boise. Yeah, yeah that's <laughs> How you doing tonight? someone else's apple juice. Sorry about that. <laughs> we'll bring one in sometime. Your water. <laughs> a little bit of a fruity taste to it. Yum. Taste water. Taste the water, yeah. That's pretty good, huh? Yeah. Oh, oh, and if, and if she, oh, and if she did have... Hello? Oh. Hello. Hey. Oh, here. Well, they hung <laughs> up again. <laughs> it's one of those nights, I guess. Here, try again. Hey. Nope. Hello. A little bit, yeah. A little bit. Hmm. Mm. <laughs> and if she did ask if we realized that this is going out on the air, then yes. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. How you doing tonight? Finally. Yay. Hi. Hi, how are you guys? Good. Hi, how are you? Sounds like Sarah. Oh, oh, yeah, it is, it is Sarah. Yeah. <laughs> it is Sarah. Hi. Good. Hi. Yeah, have you guys haven't had much calls or what? Well, not tonight. They're just, or they're not coming through really they're, good. They're not yeah. coming through, they're hanging out, but. They've been fragmented like those craters. Like those craters. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> well, actually, I haven't been home very long, so. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Oh, you've been out carousing on the town tonight? Yeah, I've been down the hall with this, this wonderful lady named Dorothy. She's 96. Oh, wow. And we've been playing Scrabble. Oh, cool. Wow. <laughs> she beat me twice. I bet she knows yeah. a lot of words. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, probably. Well, probably almost twice as many as you. Well, <laughs> probably, but but she she does all these double things, you know, like two two or three words, and she counts them each. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. She's had a long time to practice. Yes, yeah, she has. I you think know, she's a sweet lady. So, <laughs> so yeah. are you? Well, thanks. Maybe maybe <laughs> when I'm maybe when I'm ninety six, I'll have someone take care of me. Yeah, wouldn't that be nice? Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> I still have a ways to go. <laughs> well, yes. <laughs> so anyway. Yeah, and I imagine you will have many people who will yeah, jump at the chance. I think all of us will. But And my friend Melody and her son Elliot just left back to go to Lewiston today. So. Oh, wow. Yeah, okay. They, yeah, they stayed with me a week, and that was fun. Yeah, so you, but you had a good visit. Yeah, it was a good visit. But you know, I'm just, I'm really tired. You know how it is. It's such a, it's so much fun, but it just puckers you out. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but yeah. Well, it's nice. But it's, it's worth it. Yeah. <laughs> well, what have, what have you guys been doing? Uh, hanging out. <laughs> okay. Huh? Uh, have you been on vacation at all? Uh, I think this was one of the last ones we went on right there. Yeah. Which was last year, about May. I think it was May 10th. Yeah. And, and what is it? That's Craters of the Moon. Craters yeah, of the Moon. I've never been there. I've been to the sand dunes, but never. Where Where are they at? Um, they're past the dunes. If you go farther, you have to go farther. Oh. But, but um. Heading towards Arco. Oh, I see. Oh, they look really interesting. <laughs> Very. They're, they're, Daddy. they're hmm? fascinating. Hey, Daddy. Yeah. Right there, dude. Kind of the beginning yeah. of. Well, they're they're the closest that Earth gets these days to the beginning of what Earth was once like. Yeah. <laughs> many, 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 many years ago. Yep. <laughs> yes, well, thousands or, mil th thousands or billions or trillions, depending mm -hmm. upon who you ask. This is very <laughs> pretty. <laughs> very, very nice. What, what? It's you getting beat nice. up in there? Uh, yeah, I got a three-year-old He's got a little uh, massager. Yeah. You can't really see it. The, light, the light's really bad in here tonight. <laughs> it is. I burned, well, I burned out a light. Ah! Oh. Oh, there he is. <laughs> well, the sound is wonderful. Good. Yay. And the pictures are good. Woohoo. <laughs> Hi, little dude. Are you sleepy? No, he not was, tonight. He, he shouldn't oh, be too no, bad. Oh, he, he had a nap at ah, about that. seven, I guess. Oh, yeah. He's so yeah. darn cute. <laughs> ah, ah. 
<laughs> He's raring to go tonight. <laughs> yes, I think both of them are. They're just playing. You know. I guess why I did ask him off. if he was getting sleepy, didn't I? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> a few minutes ago. Hey. Yeah. Well, I guess he's been up long enough so that he's starting to show symptoms hey. of early sleepiness. Ah. Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> what? Ah. Dude, are you talking about dude or little little, little dude? What? Yeah. I can't hear you. Hear no, it. big dude got pretty good. Ah. Got pretty good sleep today. So. Oh, good. We try to we try to get him rested on Sundays as much oh. as we can. Well, yeah. that's good. We don't want to. Yeah. Have him drowsy driving. Oh no, oh. that would not be good at all. So, yeah. Okay. Okay, there. Yep. <laughs> hey, ah. Lego guy. Hey, Lego guy. Yeah. Did you guys do anything particularly over there? Different or unusual or unique? What? You and uh, Melody and Elliot and Did we do anything like that? Yeah. No, we just hung out too and then they yeah. they got to visit a lot of huh. their family cool. and stuff. And so that was nice. In fact some of their family came over here one night. It must have been about 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock in the morning when they left. Yes. And, and so I just went to bed and let them just visit. And Bunch of party animals. Yeah, we are kind of like a family. Party, party, it, was party, a, party. it was a little party. loud, but not too bad. And yeah, you know, well. They were just drinking coffee and pop. Yeah. <laughs> and so, yeah, but it was nice that Melody got to visit her family. And That's cool. Of course, Elliot... You know, he always cries and says, I don't want to go home. I'm on the live <laughs> with Sarah. Careful. But you have to be 55 to live here, so. Nope. <laughs> yeah. Elliot, you're only eight. <laughs> <laughs> only eight? No. He's only eight, so he <laughs> can't live here. You have to be 55. <laughs> right. Well, he's got a little ways to go, but oh, maybe yeah. someday. Yes. <laughs> and so does his mom. She's only like 42, so yeah. she has a long time, too. <laughs> So oh. anyhow, oh, but it was a nice visit. And, yeah. And yeah. <laughs> it's probably a nice, nice place no. to stay when she comes down, too, because uh -huh. it's probably it's fairly no. quiet. And it is, actually. Yeah, it's so. very, yeah, it's very peaceful here. It's always been so peaceful. So. I mean, that's a 55 and over don't party. <laughs> oh, they sure do, especially when they play bingo. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And, and dominoes. Well, and they got, bing <laughs> they got bingo here now through the TV studio. They do. Yep, well, they it's sure not, do. Yeah, it's not at the studio, but it's for it's the studio and three other charities. Oh. Or uh, nonprofit organizations do a bingo. I and I keep meaning to put the information up too. So. Right. Okay. Yeah, we get. TV, huh? They've oh. got more information, and they they have it they have it on their website too. I think too. So oh, interesting. On yeah, TV TV's too. website. That's so. probably the best place to get it, really. Oh, yeah. okay. But anyway, yeah, they've got bingo too. So you guys play bingo? Yeah. See, I hear that's a lot of fun. I've never really done it. Yeah, well, you know, I never thought I'd be there playing bingo. Yeah. <laughs> but here I am. No, but I had bingo. some. I had some friends when I was a teenager who did. Who they'd go with their mom and they had a blast. They loved it. <laughs> so you know, but it's just never. I've never had an opportunity. And yeah, honestly, I don't come down to town that often. Yeah. <laughs> I am mostly a homebody. To, oh, I know. You Me know, too. but. <laughs> Me too, Biscuit, but it's so homey around but, here. But you know, it's yeah, nice. it's cool that you that you have a community where you can kind of Draw. feel like you're at home even when yeah. you're Yeah, and it is a community, and everybody, oh, we all watch out for each other. I love it here. It's so nice. And I love the older people. I just love them. That's <laughs> the best thing. Older people and, and kids and, and little kitty cats. I love them, too. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. What? That is the formula for a long, well-informed life. What older people, kids, old people, and cats. kids, and kitty cats, <laughs> <laughs> and puppies are nice too. But and puppy dogs too. too. <laughs> yeah, but I'm I'm more like a cat, kitty cat person. So. <laughs> there you go. So anyhow, well, I think I'm going to go to bed. I have Kelly Kate in the morning. All righty. So I still have a sink full of dishes, but you know, <laughs> I'm the queen of my castle. I'm not going to do them tonight. <laughs> All right. I totally, totally hear you. <laughs> yeah, I can do them tomorrow. Yeah. Right, They're not going to leave. <laughs> hey, you know, and the best thing is if they do really surprise you and, like, get up and leave in the middle of the night. Yeah. That, that'd be like, you could call the Inquirer and get, like, $20,000 for that if you could prove it. So, <laughs> if any all. <laughs> Plus, it'd be great because then you wouldn't have to clean them, right? Well, that's true. That's <laughs> true. Given that they probably won't, they will still be there in the morning. Oh, yes. If I could only <laughs> teach my cats to do them, 
would be nice. <laughs> <laughs> and cats are supposed to have some of the cleanest mouths of animals, aren't they? Peace. <coughs> um, um, well, no. No? Not oh, well. exactly. Well, uh, something cleaner old. than people's mouths. <laughs> yeah, there, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Most of the pathogens in a cat's mouth can't <laughs> be passed to people is what it is, or a oh. dog's mouth for that matter. They're just not compatible between species. And I guess it just depends what they eat, too. Yeah. Well, yeah, there's that, too. <laughs> well, that's really true, I guess. But, you know, it's been proven that, um, that their saliva is very healing to wounds. Yes, that's true. Look, yeah. Yes. That's yeah, what I was thinking. Of. Yeah, that yeah, is true. They do have. Anyway, a, they do have. <laughs> yeah, excess of an enzyme. We have that same Half enzyme. Time. We just don't have as much of it because we're. Yeah. You know, but yeah, that's yeah. Uh, that is true. Maybe if we started eating cat food and dog food, we would. <laughs> I did that when I was a kid, and it kind of tastes weird now. <laughs> it does a little <laughs> bit. <laughs> And you don't you, you might not want this to happen to your kids. <laughs> <laughs> I beg to differ. Oh, yeah. <laughs> She's so kind. She's so kind. Well, I wonder what's gonna be in your meatloaf. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of protein. <laughs> what did you, what did she put in our meatloaf? What? <laughs> in your meatloaf. <laughs> you were gonna add some spice to it. <laughs> Oh well. <laughs> I think I missed because some th some things don't come through the speaker very clearly, oh, okay. so I miss things, and then well, it looks funny on the playback. Uh huh. <laughs> well, we were talking about kitty cat food and dog food, and 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 how oh, they it's, have oh, good enzymes, and and that you might make meatloaf with the cat food. <laughs> <laughs> you, you probably couldn't tell the difference. <laughs> No, you probably couldn't. You put, if you put ketchup on it, you never yeah. tell. Mix, mix it in with the, uh, you know, hamburger helper or something. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah. It's crunchier than normal, but uh, well, yeah, well, it's supposed to be that way. Texture. <laughs> well, and it has to be good enough for them to eat. It's not like it could be like poisoned or bad. Yeah. You know, it has to be essentially good food, right? Well, yeah. So yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Except they eat a lot of weird stuff. <laughs> Cats and dogs. Yep. Well, yeah, but they can, because of all those pathogen pathogens they have that don't transfer over to humans, but help yeah. them do all the things they need to do. Yeah, that's <laughs> true. That's <is> true. <laughs> I don't know. Well, anyhow, I hope you guys have a good night. Thanks, you too. <laughs> you too. Talk thanks to you later. for calling. Yeah, thanks so for I'll email you this week. Huh? I'll email you this week. Oh, that would be wonderful. Thank <laughs> you. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to have more time this week to get on there. <laughs> yeah, I think I it's probably will busy. too, but. Yeah. Okay. Okay, well, you guys have a great night and be careful driving home. Thanks, we yeah. will. Okay. Have a good night. All right, bye. Thank you. you too. <laughs> bye. Yes? Hello? That was Sarah. Oh, hey. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Hey, what's up? Hey, how you doing? <laughs> pretty good, pretty good. Yo, I've been watching your show for a while, so I just have, like, a couple questions. Okay. Go for it. Um, do you guys make the decisions that make uh, that uh, whatever goes on on the shows? Like you make all the decisions, whatever goes on. Yep. Except for the callers. Okay. Well, at least our show. <laughs> yeah, we okay. don't. We well, don't. Control. We don't have you any. Guys, oh, we go ahead, go ahead. We don't have any control over the callers, but other than that, yeah, I would say so. Yeah. Okay. Well, okay. Well, I was just thinking because I'm a local artist, and oh, okay. I was going to sure. see you guys didn't have any artwork behind your couch. I was wondering if you guys would be willing to like promote artists like weekly, have one painting like, you know, for each individual artist each week. Hey, um, we need to. What you need to do is contact us through email. Through what email. I need is if we, if I can have a little bit more phone volume in the studio, then I'll be oh, able to hear a little bit better. Okay. No, it's okay. It's just I can't. I heard something about a local artist and each week and. Okay. Oh, I was just seeing if you guys wanted to like promote like different artists because I see right behind you where you're sitting, there's mm -hmm. no art whatsoever. You know, <laughs> right, like right. There, it was perfect open, you know, That's open true. spot for artists each ah. weekend. It would be cool to you know if somebody is actually watching to, and I'm sure if I'm watching, there's many people that are out there. Well, we we know at least the people calling are watching usually. So <laughs> yeah, well, there's lots of people That's that don't right? call that still watch. So there's lots of people that don't call that still watch. I know that. Yeah. 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 <laughs> um. That would add, that's actually a fantastic idea. Uh, I had I have actually some artwork from a friend that I was I've intended to do that with, but it's been packed and I haven't been able to get it out. Oh well, 
You can put so, on an easel or something like that, and I can provide something like that too. Yeah, go ahead. You you can okay. email me or I can email you. It's moments of awareness. Just look up moments of awareness and look them up. Like yeah, right there. Okay. And uh, my email address is on the bottom of the page, or his. Either one of us, but I'll probably get back to you a little bit sooner. Maybe. Right yeah, I was the guy that called a, a long time ago and had you guys switch positions like at the end of the show. <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right on. Well. Keep going, I'll give you guys an email and I guess we'll talk later. Awesome. Great, thank you. Thanks so much right. for calling. No problem. Hey. <laughs> well, awesome. I remember that. Yep, I do too. I had to switch back though because I wasn't running the control room very well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well. It's not really my forte. Yeah, mine, sure, it sure is mine, yeah. <laughs> well, you, you do a lot better at it than I do. <laughs> I have trouble single tasking up here on the, on the stage just kind of trying to keep track of the conversation <laughs> right. and him, let alone, you know. <laughs> Hello. Hello. How you doing? No, oh, they got scared. <laughs> They're doing really, really well, but thank you. It's a Halloween tonight. Uh, apparently not there. <laughs> was that another hang up? I'm not sure. I was just answering for them. Right, right. And apparently they said they were doing really, really well. <laughs> <laughs> and then the, they hung up and... Yep. Oh, here, we'll try again. Okay, go for it. How about now? Can you hear us? Hey. You're live. <laughs> hey, I was just uh, going through the stations and seeing your show. I was wondering what it's about. What's on your mind tonight? I just wonder what your show is all about. That's what it's about, though. Yeah, we just we uh, <laughs> go live and talk to people for an hour Sundays from uh, 11 p.m. to midnight. Yeah, about just, whatever you're thinking about, or yeah, yeah just see what's uh, see what's going on, you know. Just doing anything or just watching us <laughs> bored late at night. <laughs> All right. All right. Well, thanks. <laughs> okay. Have a good night. Yeah, you too. You too. <laughs> thanks for calling. <laughs> yeah, call back anytime you have something to say. Yep. I'm always hoping that they'll just get that idea, but <laughs> yep. I should still say it because an invitation is always nice. Right. They might say to themselves, well, we don't want to bother them. They look like they're having a good time. <laughs> I don't know just what to chilling. say. I'm just not sure what to say. <laughs> oh, it's not important. What you say is not as important as how you say it. Well, sometimes what you say is really important, too. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Great. Now I'm thinking. What? I shouldn't do that. Be loved, man. Be loved. <laughs> the Beatitudes. Matthew 5 is one of my favorite books in the Bible. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Whoa! How you doing? So we've got about 31 minutes left. Please don't snap my chest right now. I've got a microphone. <laughs> Half milk. He's gonna keep saying it until I say yes. Because I'm not gonna say yes. And then you're just gonna keep saying it. Half milk. 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 Half <laughs> shadow. Big gray shadow. Huh? They have milk? <laughs> <laughs> there we know, bud. Have milk. Got milk? <laughs> milk, it does a body good. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Ask him. What? Yeah. No, him. Oh, yeah. No, you too. Him too. But him too. He drinks half and half out of the carton. <laughs> wow. We have to buy. Right. He's been drinking that a lot. <laughs> Every time he's going for a growth spurt, man. Just like you said that. You know? <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> you were walking along here just holding the camera by the strap, right? I was just hanging it like as at the bottom of my arm or something, like as low as I could hold it. Great. That's so cool. I love that for 
perspective. <laughs> yeah, isn't that cool? I know. I was like, hey, I gotta try this. <laughs> well, and it's pretty steady too. You know, it's not real shaky. Not, not like you'd expect for me, and just you know, just hanging free. Right. Oh, by the way, if you go to Craters of the Moon, I don't recommend bare feet. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. <laughs> and I can walk on pretty much anything Ouch. in bare feet, and I did pretty well out there even, but... Well, I tried it even just a little bit, and I was like, nope, no way. Yeah. <laughs> I have, like, sensitive feet. He does. Well, he's a Pisces. That's to be expected. <laughs> huh. I gotta learn the, like, baseball <laughs> park theme, man. <laughs> The baseball park theme? Dun, 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 dun. You mean that one? Yeah, I just, this is more, well, of course, this is more deep purple. Isn't that, isn't that copyrighted by Harry Carey or something like that? Probably. Oh, <laughs> I'm Harry Carey. <laughs> yeah, this is kind of like a mild, uh, not quite a deep purplish. It's a dude riff, man. It's a dude Jawe riff. Man. <laughs> yeah, Mark, Mark, good buddy, wants me to do more bass stuff, man. So. Yeah. We really, really, really need to get Mark out here to build us a speaker system when we can. Yeah, dude, man. Mark, what's that. up, man? Oh. See this gnarly footage, man? I need some bass to, like, rock the mountains. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, hey, what the heck? <laughs> It's more of that alien kind of stuff, man. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> How short your hair is there, buddy? <laughs> no, it's, you know, I'm just saying. <laughs> Someone said to me this week, hmm. um, One, but he, one of them, <laughs> I think it was Elizabeth, but he said she was surprised I'm only five foot three and a half. <laughs> oh, yeah. And Colleen goes, That's because she has such a towering presence. And I said, Well, sometimes it's called overbearing. Yeah. <laughs> but that's a nice way of putting it. Right, right, right. And then. It depends on where you hold the camera, man. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So that's what I was thinking. That's what it made me think of. It made me think of it. Yeah, it depends on your perspective. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah. I said, no, sometimes people are actually disappointed when I walk into a room. Because they expect me to be taller. Because <laughs> I look taller on TV. <laughs> Which isn't that funny. Maybe that's the 10 pounds it adds. Maybe it adds 10 pounds height-wise. Yeah, makes you taller too. <laughs> well, everybody thinks I'm five foot six or five foot seven, and it's like, <laughs> well, that's because that's an average height. And it's just kind of what you imagine would fill the screen of your television, but that's just all p position of the cameras. Half the time, guys in the movies that seem taller than the women that they're making out with right. are shorter. Right. But you know, with boxes and tricks of the camera and various things, they make it look like they're just these towering hulks. Right. Beasts. French fries for me. Which is funny because, like Ben Affleck has said that, um, he was told he was too big for Hollywood because he's six foot one. And then he'd never be able to be cast in, you know, movies and especially television. Right. Because he just would be too big. But apparently he's... <laughs> Prove that wrong. <laughs> That's cool. 
<laughs> it's kind of <laughs> cool. Dude. <laughs> this is an original dude riff. We're waiting on some um, reggae that's coming from our friend Illicit. He's, he is his stage name. He's a DJ in Florida and a reggae artist. <laughs> and it'll be cool when that comes. He's really good. Yeah, he's better than me. <laughs> I, I, I wouldn't say that. Different, but, different. Yeah. Different. But that's just me. I know some people would. And so, oh, by the way, this is Moments of Awareness with Peace and the Dudes. Right, And right. we come to this studio from 11 to midnight every Sunday night and, and play chill out with and talk to people. Toys. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? And play with our toys. Play with toys. <laughs> and you can come make your own show, which would be fantastic, or else you could send us some material for your show. You could feel free to send it to the studio, Care of Moments of Awareness. I'm sure they'd see that it gets to us. Uh, and we'd be happy to and just you know send any credits that need to go with it with it <laughs> right man yeah 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 see I told Melissa a long time ago I asked her if I had permission to show her artwork on the air but then um her artwork happens to be buried in some boxes that are buried yeah, in I know, the attic I know how that goes man <laughs> and I don't think you want to go up there and unbury them <laughs> Yeah, no, I can totally relate though. Uh, relate? You could be glad because otherwise you'd be the one going up to get them. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. <laughs> Some of those boxes I couldn't even come close to moving and I'm pretty strong. Yeah, you're. That's awesome. Good music. <laughs> Thanks, man. It's pretty crafty, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> crafty? Yeah. How so? Because it's RT and Crafty, you mean like that, or? That's the name of the sound. It's what? The name of the song is Crafty. No, the sound. Sound. Oh, okay. <laughs> it was a good sky that day too. Oh, that was such a perfect day. Almost a North Carolina sky. Hello, you're live. <laughs> hey. Ah, that might be go. what scares him, man. <laughs> what, what Hello, you're live! Hello! You're live, man! <laughs> <laughs> Hi! Hey, hey, what's happening? How you doing? Good. <laughs> We're doing good. What is this show going on here? <laughs> what? What uh, is this show going on? This is crazy. <laughs> yeah, that's the name of this uh, actual the program, or the sound I'm playing, man. <laughs> it's called crazy. Oh, it's crazy. I think awareness. you just made it up, bro. All oh, right. <laughs> right. Well, sort of. I did actually. I made it up. It's, I named it Crafty because it sounds kind of crafty. Oh, well, that's cool. <laughs> anyway, this is Moments of Awareness with Peace and the Dudes, and we come to the studios every Sunday night from 11 to midnight, and we talk to people. If anyone wants to call us. So otherwise, you just sit and idle. Yeah. Otherwise, we just kind of sit around and hang out and, and watch our home movies. Show home movies, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> Creators of the what Moon. Do you shoot out of? Pardon? Where do you shoot out of it? Are you Boise, Idaho? In Boise, Idaho. Yeah, it's cable, uh -huh. cable access here, TV, TV. You could do it too. Channel, channel 11. But oh, you have really? to get your own time slot because this one's taken. Yeah. Oh, I got time you. slot, I said. Time slot. <laughs> Is it good? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Do anyway, I sound good on the air? You sound awesome on the air. Oh. I honestly <laughs> think you should get your own show. <laughs> It's well, like you have little, like you have an announcer's voice, man. Totally. This little girl walking around in the. No, that's, that's our son. That's our son, dude, Junior. Yeah, he's here oh, right now. Oh, sorry. No, that's all no, right, it's man. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's the dreadlocks. Hair. It's the hair. You were walking him. You were walking him on the rocks. Uh, no, he's got you know. sandals on. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I you were. Yeah, viewing down. Yeah, nice dress. Aren't they cool? Thanks. Yeah. yeah. I can't believe I'm live on TV. I was looking at this number going. What is that? Yeah. Is that real? What is that? <laughs> yeah. Am I yeah. supposed to call that? <laughs> if you want to, you don't have to. Some people are like, oh, man, I ain't calling them guys, man. What the heck? What's this? <laughs> we get a lot of hang-ups, too. Yeah. That's a lot oh, of fun. Yeah? You, had, you had a lot of guts being being willing to actually speak once once we answered. Well, yeah, I thought I was tripping <laughs> out, man. <Right. laughs> I was like, I'm that, ready to hear my voice on the yeah, radio, yeah. you know, echoing, and it did. 
Yeah, you can, <laughs> and we're gonna we'll put this on YouTube uh, in a little while once we finish doing the show. Wednesday, Thursday, so Friday. like you can actually tune we'll in. You'll be able to corner. hear. You'll be able to be like, hey man, that's me, and you'll have Tell to all your friends to go watch your <laughs> watch you on TV. Hey man, I talked on Moments of Awareness, man. I'm on YouTube. And then, and then yeah, you hey, <laughs> I feel I might be famous one day. Why not? You probably should be. Uh, I'm going to write a book. Okay. Awesome. Called uh, Expansive Thinking. Expansive oh. Thinking? Expansive Thinking, yeah. Thinking Outside the Box. And there's another one called Simply Complex. That sounds that's that's cool. That's awesome. Yeah. Now, what's kind of the gist? Can you say? or What's that? Is this something Simply you're already... Complex? Are you already... Go ahead. Go ahead. No, you go ahead. Whoa, whoa. I was just wondering what the gist is of the books and what kind of the... Well, Simply Complex is just kind of like, uh, I'm thinking... Simply Complex. One word might mean more than many, many different things, you know, one word. Exactly. It's kinda awesome. like, kinda it like, has many different meanings, so you can use it in many different fashions. Yeah, kind of like mom smoke? moments of awareness. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's, that's awesome. Oh, hey. What's his name? This is little dude. That's dude, dude Jr. That's How you doing, junior. bro? <laughs> you want to talk? How you doing? He's asking how you doing. Hey, hello. <laughs> he, he, he's, he's, he's being shy. <laughs> <No>? <laughs> okay, well, how you doing, doing bro? <laughs> he's talking to you. Dude Jr. Yeah. So you're just talking to you. I'm Canadian. Are you? Yeah, originally born in Canada. No kidding. Yeah, we're from Minnesota, so we're practically Canadian. <laughs> eh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> when I moved from Canada, I moved to Michigan. Oh, did you? No kidding. Yeah, yeah my uh, wife was born in Michigan, and... Uh, that would be me. My mom lived in you, Michigan as well. Where about Petoskey? Uh, she was in Birmingham. Uh, Peace was in uh, I was born Lansing. in Lansing. Lansing? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But we moved when I was a year and a half old, so I don't remember really anything. What brought you all out here? To Idaho? Yeah. Um, that. Well. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> that. <laughs> a lot of that. Yeah, yeah really. Was, that's that's what brought that's what brought me back. So. Yeah. I was building a nice deck uh, out in some beautiful land like that. Yeah. Earlier last week. Yeah. Oh, cool. Is that what yeah. you do, or? Did you get to spend any time sitting on it and enjoying it? Actually, yeah. Me and my buddy, we rolled way out to the end of this road where there was just nothing in it. Nothing. Yeah. Nothing. Yeah. You know, and then the mountain range. Yeah. Cool. So, I mean, we drove way out there, and it was just like, it made me think, you know, God creating this planet and everything. Yeah. How long, how long have you been, how long have you been in Idaho? On and off about uh, seven years. Oh, cool. 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 Uh, back, back and forth between here and uh, Michigan. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Cool. Yeah. Still got family out there? Yeah, actually, my brother's thinking of buying a house. Yeah. Cool. That's pretty exciting, but yeah, my dad's also writing a book too, but he's way ahead of me. Well, he's had more years. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he was a minister for 23 years, so he kind of got an understanding, but yeah. now it's more like God meets you where you're at, you know? Yeah. Yeah. What what uh, denomination did he? We were Christian days, but uh, he it just turned out in a way that I was disappointed, you know, for sure. He turned, he turned what? Oh, sorry. This phone is terrible. <laughs> <laughs> and like, I can hear an echo in the background of it. Oh, because oh. the TV? Yeah. <laughs> Probably through here, yeah. Um, no, but he, you, you said you were disappointed about what? No, I uh, grew up disappointed in religion itself, you know? Oh, yeah. So I created something different, which was my relationship with God. Yeah. But, you know, I'm a very scientific person, too, yeah. so things, things make sense. Yeah. But I guess inevitably what you have to do is just slow down and smell the flowers. Yep. I totally agree. That's what we were doing right there. Yeah, right? <laughs> yep. It's fun. Little teeny itty bitty craters of the moon I've flowers. Been, uh, I've been rafting here once, sorry to cut you off, but no, I, that's fine. No, that's great. I keep on feeling like I'm going to get cut off here, you know? I don't get enough time to talk. Well, we've got 15 minutes till we go off the air, so... <laughs> <laughs> Nobody else is calling in? Well, they can't call while you're well, on, of course. They might be. Yeah, you never know. Oh. It's all right. That, but we're, we're talking to you right now. Sister? We're talking to we're, you right we're now. We're talking to you right now. All right. Is that apple juice right there? <laughs> 
That yeah. is some apple juice over yeah. there, yeah. That looks good, yeah. And V8, <laughs> V8. I don't yeah. like V8 so much. But. Yeah, that's like the... This what? is actually water. Oh, right. And I should turn it around because I don't want any branding on the, on the air. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So my name is Ben. Ben? Yeah. Let me write that down. I like to write down names of people who choose to give us their names. Well, then if you're going to write it down, you might as well write Benjamin. Benjamin. Awesome. Yeah. I had a banner jamming with you. What was that? Chandon. Were you singing? What? said, I the band of jamming with you. <laughs> okay, there you go, yeah. Yeah, I don't have any reggae yet, but we're, we're waiting for some. We're waiting for some, yeah. That's what we're <laughs> really waiting for. Where is it? It's in the mail, apparently. Oh, really? Yeah. Hey, yeah. It better be this time, I'm telling you that. <laughs> he knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> Benjamin. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Look at my nice turn on book, isn't that great? <laughs> no, that's all right. I've got a three-year-old. I'm kind of used to it. Yeah. You know how it goes. <laughs> well, unless you don't have a three-year-old, in which case you probably have some idea how it goes, but you may not know exactly how it goes. But you probably have a good enough idea to have a pretty close estimation. Yeah, he's he's helping me out here. In the now, don't you wish you'd have got cut off? <laughs> <laughs> oh, not at all. No, I live with a. <laughs> he's about two and a half. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, ours um, is he's, three. He's one of my roommates' uh, boys. Say what? I said he's one of my roommates' uh, boys. He's, he's two and a half years old. Oh, yeah, uh huh. Yeah, my phone's cool. really bad. Oh, no, I wasn't sure. Uh, no, I, I didn't know. It's, oh. not in, it, it's not entirely your phone. It's just sometimes it's the audio here, too. So. What are you talking oh, about, man? <laughs> uh, his name's Asher, yeah, and he lives here. Cool. So you're kind of, oh, so you are used to it, so you know. Hopefully. Yeah, I know what it is. I, I, you know, I'm excited for me when I do it. <laughs> when I uh, have children. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Hopefully he knows to stay out of your stuff, but there's times when you just don't feel like saying, don't tear the pages out of my notebook right now. <laughs> right. And, <laughs> and sometimes you just got to let them push the buttons on in and the you control just say, room. You know, <laughs> I'll deal with it another day because today I've got to deal with other issues. You know how it is. I'm guessing because you're living with a two, two and a half year old. So. Yeah. So in any case, uh, did you mention what came out, what brought you out here seven years ago, or did you want oh, to? Yeah. I mean, <laughs> definitely family. Yeah. Oh, your family's out here. And you're. Oh, okay. Well, silly me. Did I miss that earlier? Oh, they came. No, no, they came out. Uh, before we did, before I did. Oh. Yeah. And then you came out and then you just decided to kind of stay and, but kind of go back and forth? Mm hmm Oh, so that works out well. I've been to Oklahoma, that place is pretty cool. Oklahoma? Yeah. You know, I've never been to Oklahoma. Is it cool? It's hot. It's hot and humid. Really? Dirty. Huh, I would always, I always thought dry. <laughs> no way, no way, man. That, no, here's dry. Well, yeah. Well, no, I would. It I just. Dry. I guess I just because I think of Texas as dry. Yeah. You know, so I just kind of figured Oklahoma was kind of in the dry alley. Well, so we, it's not uh, we live surrounded by water, amazingly, you know. Oh. And it was in a place called Ponca City. Uh huh. Yeah, and it was uh, up north oh. of uh, Oklahoma. Yeah. Well, maybe that's it, because I do have a friend who is from Oklahoma, and she says that part of it's really dry and part of it's really humid. But I didn't know she. I didn't know it was a big part that was humid. I kind of thought it was just like the panhandle part, just the little uh -huh. itty bitty part over there. So that's kind of cool. You learn something new every day, right? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Never been to Oklahoma, though. So uh, how long have you all been here then? Uh, a little over three years now. Where, where did you come from now? Uh, where Min did you come from? Directly from North Carolina. No, no, you said... Um, from Minnesota uh, originally. Yeah. Yeah. We both grew up in Minnesota, yeah. But then we had moved to North Carolina, and then we moved here. Hmm. Yeah. Kind of same path as my family, really. Mm -hmm. They went to Virginia Beach. Oh, really? Yeah, Navy? and then they moved out here, yeah. Were they Navy? Pardon me? Were they Navy? I just still didn't hear you. Were they in the Navy? No, they were not in the Navy. Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, you sound surprised at the question. <laughs> Well, my dad's an Englishman and my mom's an American, so. Oh. And I was born in Canada. Oh, oh, wow. That's so, cool. 
<laughs> I'm all messed up. <laughs> no, that's an interesting that's mix. Funny. So, do you spend time at all? Does he? Do you spend time in England at all, or in Canada? Yeah, I've been over to England when I in my childhood. You know, yeah. when the ministry used to pay mm -hmm. for us to go back and visit. Cool. Yeah, I mean, so like every three years we'd go back and visit. That's cool. But since then, you know, we have a pl uh, trip planned in like September. So we want to go over there and see my grandma. She's like 82. Cool. So, is he yeah. an Episcopalian minister? No, it was a Christian band. Christian. Well, I thought Episcopalian was Christian. I don't know. Well, I don't know. Because I was thinking that's the Church of England, I think, but I could be wrong about that. Well, see, he was Catholic originally. Oh, okay. He was Catholic, and uh, he, he went to Christian on his own, Christianity on his own. Oh, okay. Kind of against the parents, you know? Okay, yeah. Huh. So, Interesting journey, huh? What's that? Interesting journey. Your life yeah, right. and... Yeah. <laughs> cool. Cool. Hold it tight. What about yeah, some music? Yeah, hold it tight. <laughs> what? So. What about some music? Oh, yeah. Um, my son's been distracting me in here. <laughs> yeah, he's kind of got he's... his headphones half off. <laughs> <laughs> that's what that There's a, that's a That's a kid stuck to me. <laughs> yeah. How you doing? Ow. <laughs> that was my microphone. Here, let me yeah, fix that. Yeah, that was probably loud. Yeah. <laughs> you get any <laughs> feedback from that? No, not too bad. Check. Mic check one, really? two. Yeah. Mic check. check. Mic check. check. Gravity check, too, I think. And maybe we should fill in the viewers. Th this is Moments of Awareness with Peace and the Dudes, and we're talking to Benjamin. Right. Here mm. in Idaho, Boise, Idaho, or somewhere in the surrounding area. Yeah, and this is... And, this uh, background stuff is Craters of the Moon. Uh-huh. And I'm eating the Reese's Pieces. Hey, and we just had some... some Reese's Pieces. <laughs> <laughs> Reese's Pieces Rock. That rose looks really cool. I like that rose. Yeah, it's really that, nice. It's really so nice, nice, nice up maintained. there. Are you on bikes? No, no. we're driving. Wow. And then they have walking paths, you know, but... So, it, yeah, it's worth it's worth going. It's just like a whole surreal landscape. It's very... Yeah. Yeah, right? Unique, yeah. Yeah, yeah we're driving Plus, down it's due to go off any time, and you'd want to see it before it goes off again. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I guess. If I get there, I will, huh? <laughs> <laughs> well, if you get there... to a lot of other places, too, huh? Oh, I don't like know. around the world and stuff like that. Who, us? I want to go around the oh, world you and stuff. Go. You yeah. know, I want to go see Egypt. <laughs> Egypt? That'd be, that'd be yeah, pretty Yeah, that cool. would be awesome. Yeah. Listen, I'll, I'll tell you one thing. I'll make you a deal. If you do go to these places, like in September, you have to call us and tell us how your trip went. <laughs> okay, to England, or and if, if you go to Egypt, you have to call us and tell us how that went, because... For sure. That's cool stuff. <laughs> yeah. For sure. I love to hear first person accounts, you know. I'm not so big on like travel guides and you know. I could totally travel around and be happy, you know, and just tell people about things. That would be awesome. You be should like, get a job like, doing that. And you you know what you should do? You should take uh you should take a camera with you, take a video camera with you and then make a show for cable access when you get back. <laughs> yeah. Like just a little show about like wherever you went. All right, well, then how am I going to pay for this trip if I'm not being uh, sponsored? Oh, well, I don't know. <laughs> uh, save your money. I thought, I thought you were going to find the right bro? Save your money, <laughs> buy a digital camera. Get a job, <laughs> duh. Yeah, you know, <laughs> that's well, like us. We, well, we grab, grab our old digital camera, cruise up the crater of the moon. And they, <laughs> might like, they might let you check one out and take it to England. I don't know. From here. Check one out. One yeah. of those big heavy ones. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> Yeah, I'll carry that on the I'm just airplane. Just filming your country, <laughs> China. Why well, not? You gotta, you gotta bring some buddies and then act like you're a film crew for some, you know, some production buddies, company. So I gotta bring some beef. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm a pretty healthy sized guy, you know. I think I intimidate a lot of people. So who's gonna bother you about having a camera and taking pictures? And right. Like, you know, nothing at all. I'm just making so, some excitement out of them. Uh, piss off! I'm fun. a bloody American. <laughs> <laughs> I can totally can't be like telling the truth on three different. Situations, well, you could, British. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm Canadian, uh, whatever, Canadian, whatever works. And then that's the peace one. They're like, oh, he's Canadian. He's yeah. cool. All right. Well, there you go. Right. They play a lot of hockey, man. <laughs> Should have taken See? a left there. Where are you going? I'm watching the video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, I won't. I won't say a lot for my my camera skills. <laughs> Well, they're your camera skills. Yeah, that's, that's, that's me, yeah. Video I was camping. just going to come down on your man there. Oh, oh, no, no. I'm, I'm the one driving the car. I thought, it was all, I thought it was all part of the thing. 
I totally thought it was all part of the, the video, you know, how you shot it. Uh, uh, that's her style, yeah. That's, it, yeah. that's Peace's style of photography. Yeah. It's called, that's, it's called it's, professional it's, amateur. It's cinema verite. <laughs> Damn, dog. Can I pick that up at the store? <laughs> uh, I that? Eventually, yeah. Professional amateur. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Once we market it. Prosumer, yeah, that's it. Oh, I thought of a new beverage, but I can't say it on air because someone might take it. Yeah, you got to patent it first, man. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was going to say it's... All I can say is that it's refreshing. Good. Just the name of a company. I actually haven't made the product yet. Well, at least you know what direction you're trying to go. Right. Refreshing. 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 You have like a world of possibilities with a refreshing beverage. And you can write about your journey to creating this refreshing beverage right. oh, in your geez. book. <laughs> or in another <laughs> book. Then you'd have three books. In numerous other books, right? Yeah. Well, I think those are two good titles. Well, well, those are definitely right. good. Bands of thinking and uh, simply complex. So you're like a title guy. Almost you're done. really good with like Maybe. naming and titling and. Well, see, I'm all about making it simply complex. So one time I wrote my theory about God Careful. on the back of a napkin. Yeah. And well, actually, it was actually yeah. on the stage of the creation of the universe. Uh huh. But then on the reverse side was my explanation of God and why He's so immense in half the words. Right. And anyone I read it to was like, whoa, whoa, dude, that's so deep. Right, and it's on a napkin. And you're just yeah. going, and you're going, it just makes I sense to me. I was just drinking <laughs> scotch in the bar, you know? Right. See, that's the kind of thing you need to write down or document in some way and show people. That's awesome. Well, it's a matter of time, you know, process I know. for you. Yeah. yeah. Do something like right that. I wish no. I could. You have to humble no. yourself. And Wish I could do this all the time. <laughs> Believe me, we understand. Twenty-four-seven. <laughs> what do you do? Well, no we dri drive saying, around and make TV. <laughs> I'm just saying. It's pretty cool. One day, make it happen. One day, over time. Well, yeah. Well, it's a, it's a combination. I mean, it's simply a, not a combination, but it's all put together. All those days put together to make one day where you actually <laughs> something with that idea. You know. Right. So. It's definitely been a learning process. I appreciate everything I've learned. Yeah. It's just it's been difficult and challenging and <laughs> overwhelming at times, you know. He used to smoke. Look. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I did, didn't I? Did yep. You quit? Yeah. Yeah, I quit. <laughs> Good. <laughs> That's funny. I chew every once in a while. Yeah. Yeah. Well, but only we, when I'm working. We we wanted to lose some weight that we had gained when we first came out here, so. Yeah. Kind of helped actually. Yep. <laughs> I like bike riding. Yeah, that's a lot healthier way to do it. It is a lot healthier not way to like, do it. Not in like spandex and stuff like that. <laughs> you don't want, right. you don't wear the butt floss in the helmet. Well, the helmet's important. I don't want to offend any <laughs> bikers out there. I have a lot of bike friends, you know, but uh, the spandex is too much, guys. Yeah. There's, there's no offense meant in that. I mean, honestly. I yeah, like to see that. I like to Are show my package. You think care about your spandex, aren't you? Yeah, show your. I mean, really, exactly, what are we exactly. talking about here? Exactly. Talking about spandex. <laughs> yep. <laughs> you too so are, you, are you more of a mountain biker or are you a road biker who doesn't have <laughs> spandex? Or I'm a nothing biker right now because I haven't been on a bike in like two years. Or <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, you know, I, I do enjoy it. Yeah. I it's not spandex. Myself. Yeah. yeah. You know, I got a little <laughs> bit of weight I could lose too, that's for sure. But I'm definitely planning on doing that, you know. Summer's coming. Especially with a... Uh, future family and stuff like that. Yeah. Are you engaged? No, no. I'm just oh. uh, <laughs> yet to find her, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Cool. Yeah. Well, maybe we'll, maybe we'll pass you coming down one of these days. If you see someone with a camera hanging out the window of a Subaru, that's probably me. What type of Subaru? What year is it? Oh, five. Yeah. Nice. I do sometimes snap bikers on the way by, and they always, they're, I think, I just learned recently that people tend to throw things at bikers out there oh, uh, up on the, on the road to Lucky Peak and whatnot. You mean bikers is as in pedal bikers? As in pedal bikers, yeah, I was shocked. People, you know, people. Say, are they throwing stuff with the bikers on the choppers? I that's. Mean, Jesus, I would not take that. Oh, I don't think on the choppers. I know, I'll do that. 
But anyways, these guys on bikes. So I'm trying to picture like these guys on a big Harley getting stuff chucked at them. I just don't think it's gonna happen. No, I had a I had a buddy I worked with <laughs> that uh, I had a no, buddy okay. I worked it's, with that got people would throw people would throw like pop bottles and stuff at them, and I mean. <laughs> Yep. He said that it was really he surpri- he was surprised you know he's like he didn't expect that. Well, I'm surprised that you did that. It's kind not of cool, me. you know. It's not cool. No, not at all. But you know there is a safety issue there. The roads are tight, and I know how it's just for driving the mountains, you know. And uh, yep. it's difficult when you come around the corner and someone's sitting there. Well, I don't think it makes you safer <laughs> when you start chucking things at people on the road. Oh, no, it doesn't. <laughs> we're we're I mean, off the air now. <laughs> Maybe it does. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right, probably you. not too much. All right, y'all. Yep. All well. right. Well, have a good night. Yeah. Thanks for Call calling us back me. again. Okay. <laughs> I will. Have a good one. See you later. Okay. One. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. Bye.